I was keeping a secret. Something bad happened after school. I was scared to tell my mom because I thought she would say it was my fault. After I told her what happened, she said I was brave. Now we're going to visit a safe place where we can talk about it. My name is Drew Mitchell. I am a forensic interviewer at Kids First. My role is to listen to kids and talk with kids who may or may not have been victims of or witnesses to crime. I'm Emily Huff. I am a victim advocate at Kids First. Victim advocates walk families through the process. I'm Deanna St. Germain. I'm the medical director at Kids First. I examine children for whom there's concern for abuse and neglect or having been victims of crime or witness crimes. The reason that child abuse intervention centers exist is it's trying to centralize services for kids. So when kids go through these traumatic events, rather than having to have them go to a bunch of different places, it's having the community come to them to serve them in one central location by only having to tell their story a minimal amount of times in a supportive place, then they're not having to go through reliving things with different people. Abuse is pretty secretive. Families feel pretty isolated. A lot of the times parents will come in and say, I have, I have no idea what to do. And so we really educate them on how important therapy is and really just making sure that they're heard. Being a kid in general, I think you're constantly being told what to do and what not to do. And so when they come into Kids First, my hope is that they know that they are in control. My hope is that I can have that connection with them to where they feel comfortable enough to, to talk about what their experiences are and to be as truthful as possible and to get as much detail as I can about whatever their experiences are to help our investigative team to move forward with their jobs. Being out of abusive situations means that they can get the help that they need and become happy, thriving members of our society. To see the difference of a kid when they first go in and are kind of nervous and scared, um, and then they come out and they're like carrying themselves different, they've got a smile on their face, you can just see like all that weight lifted off. I consider myself pretty lucky that I get to be a part of that.